Okay, second topic is variables and data types. I already created the file. Let's open this. Variables and data types. What are variables in Python? How you can declare them? You can consider these variables same as you considered them in mathematics. So if you write a is equals to 10, what this statement implies is a holds the value of 10. If you want to print the variable, you just use this. This time you do not use double quotes. If you use double quotes, it will print as it is. It will print the whole statement as it is. You don't want to print a, you want to print the value of a. Okay. So if you want to print variables, you just use them without double quotes or single quotes. Okay. Let's run this. It will print, it will print. If you want to use different types, for example, if I write a is equals to, so b equals to 10.65 and want to print the value of b, you just write it like this. Okay. Python supports dynamic data types. What this means, you do not have to mention like this, that a is 10 or 20, just like in C, C++ and previous languages. So. Uh, we are not going to mention this. It will detect automatically, dynamically that this particular A is an integer. Okay. Let me change this or create another variable C, for example. I am writing a string with it. For example, if I write Indore or you can say India. If I print the value of C, it will print India. Okay. So different type of variables hold different type of values. You do not, do not have to mention any data type here. So how can we check what type of variable the variable is holding or type of variable it is. So we have data types or you can say we have help type function. We can use type function here. What this means, if we have a value of 10 and if you want to print the value of A, also you want to check what type of variable this A is. You can use type function. There's an inbuilt function in Python. Whenever you use type function, it will return the type of that variable or you can say the data type of the variable. Okay. Uh, you already know how board mass in mathematics works. First, the bracket will be solved. Whatever the output, the inner bracket will be solved. After that, the outer brackets will be solved. So first type function will work here and it will generate the type of A or give us the, what are the, uh, what is the type of A and print statement will print it. If I run this, you will see like this. First statement prints 10. And the second statement prints int. Okay. So int is a class in Python. Int represent integers. All the integers will consider as the object of int class. You will see class here. So this we will um, talk about classes and objects later. But you have to focus on this particular part for now. Okay, let's move forward and create some other type of variables. For example, if I write 10.65 and print the value of B, I want to check what type of data it holds. So if I write type of B, it will print float. Float represents all the decimal values. So if you write this, um, any type of decimal values, it will be considered as float. Okay. Let's move forward and give another value. For example, if I write India and print C along with its type, type of C, it will return str. str represents string. String is the collection of characters. Whatever you see in double quotes or single quotes, it will be considered as string, string type. Okay. So this is how data type work in Python. You can apply some of the 
operations with it. For example, if I write a is equals to 10 and want to add 5 in it, for example, if I write a plus 5, it will return and print the value of a is 10, 10 plus 5 will be 15 and it will print 15. Let's see if it will change uh, the value of a. No, it will not change the value of a. Why? Because here you are adding the value in a and just printing it. You do not assigning it again into a. For example, if you write 10 and if you want to change the value of a and add 5 to it like this, a plus 5. If you print a, now the value of a is changed and the output will be 15. 10 plus 5 will be 15, 15 will be assigned to a. Let's run this, you will get the output. Okay, so this is how variables work in Python. You can use type function, type function will give you the type of particular variable. Okay, there are different types in Python, there are so many other types as well. But for now, um, we are considering these for, for beginners, obviously. Okay. Let's move to the another topic and add, end this topic here. Okay.